Uh, it's like I told the, uh, our kids after the game, it wasn't pretty. I mean, there were times that, that, you know, we didn't play good basketball, but there were stretches we played really good basketball. And uh, just proud to see that uh, we are now uh, what I feel like is a complete team. On any given night, anybody can step up and score for us and do the things that we need them to do. What do we have, four kids in double figures again? That just shows the evolution of us becoming a team. And uh, we got a lot of kids that are playing hard and doing good things and not only uh, scoring the basketball, but making good defensive plays and rebounding the ball and, and making good decisions for us. And um, uh, I, I could have told you Macy Turley was going to come out and have a night because it, she's hard to keep down. You're not going to keep her down for long. And I know she's been frustrated with the way she's been shooting the basketball. So I knew she was going to come out tonight and really look to score. And uh, once she got going, I knew she was going to go pretty big. Well, Offensively, though, who got you going early was Lex with a broken nose. Yeah, we might break something else if we need to, but uh, she uh, she's just back in that zone. I mean, that's the Lex I know. When she shoots it and it doesn't go in, I'm back to being surprised it didn't go in. You know, went through that stretch really having a tough time confidence-wise, but she's got all the confidence in the world shooting it from deep, uh, just letting it fly, and that's what you want shooters to do. But, you know, Lex's game – is evolved into a player that can shot fake and get into the lane and make things happen as well. So these kids are really coming along, and a lot of a lot of our players have improved, and I think that that's part of the reason that we're successful uh, for the last three games. The offense continues to look as fluid as it ever has been. What do you kind of attest to that? Well, we've been talking a lot about pace and uh, playing with more pace and really running to the screens and setting good screens and going hard at everything that we do. The ball movement's been better. We've just been getting ourselves in better positions. Uh, we were real stagnant there for a long time, but, you know, we finally got the personnel on the floor that we feel like can move the basketball. And, uh, you know, again, we've, we've been getting those kind of shots all year, but we're finally starting to make those shots, and I think that's been the turning point for us. Lex leads you. Yeah, for sure. You know, teams try to take her away. Anybody scout says they everything goes through five. So, we, you know, we've got some stuff that we run offensively that we move her off the ball, trying to run her off some screens, get her a little rest at times from having to handle the ball all the time. And, and Alexis has just been doing a really good job for us. And uh, Alexis also gets mismatches because a lot of times on the floor she's our four. So the people guarding her are fours as well. And as you know, Alexis can go by people. She didn't do as good a job finishing tonight as she normally does. But we know she can get to the rim anytime we want her to. So we've got some different things that we're looking at offensively just to try to, to, try to keep uh, other teams off balance. Yeah, well, I told her uh, going into tonight, I said, listen, I said, I said, I know you can do it, but I want you to go out there and get a double-double uh, on Saturday night because I think if you do that, that we might could talk somebody into uh, nominating you for OVC Player of the Week because after the stats she had on Thursday and the stats she had tonight with us getting two wins first sweep of the season, so uh, I would really love to see her get that. Now, there's a lot of good players in our conference and a lot of people put up big numbers this week. But I think just to have her name mentioned in that talk means a lot to her, and it definitely means a lot to me. You want to see players rewarded for their work. Well, partly she's been taken away by injury. She's got a high ankle sprain. She didn't play the uh, – she played – didn't play the four games leading up to the Austin P game, and she tried to play about seven minutes at Austin P. She didn't play a whole lot tonight. So, so she's limited because of her injury. She's a very good player. But, I mean, we definitely had her in the scouting report, and we, we knew the, the things that she liked to do. And our, our kids did a really good job of personnel again tonight defensively. Now, we had some, some misses and, and didn't get out to the number four, which was their shooter a couple times. But for the most part, our kids are doing a really good job in preparing for the games through the scouts.